So we now know that Motoko Kusanagi will go to the final. Who will she face there? It is now time for the final match of the women's qualifying for the OBD Women's Championship. First up, Lena Inverse. The number four seed, and you know, anyone who takes on the opponent she's about to take on must feel in the back of their head very daunted but I do think Lena has the attack power to put her down. This is the first time these two have fought one versus one, is it not? It is. I think this is the first time they've fought, period. History may just be made tonight. I mean, it's been made right now, and the match ain't even started. I think Lena does have the power to take her out, especially if she brings out the Giga Slave. And if there's ever a time to bring it out, it is now. The house is on fire in Niigata, Japan. I must say it. Will we see it? Will we see the Giga Slave against the Juggernaut in this tournament? She may need it because this is going to be the toughest opponent she's ever faced. Oh, yes. And you know, it begs the question how much Teresa has learned ever since the loss she took at Ragnarok from the Geno Cyber. Judging by her performance this year so far, what can you say? She's either learned a lot, or she's totally learning is totally not needed because what can you say about her she's been perfect so far because i feel like she must have lost something only to gain something even greater but can she fully utilize it to take her where she really needs to go only time will truly show us what she has to bring i mean i've said it over and over again has she indeed lost something something about her that was crucial to her becoming that undefeated juggernaut that we saw last year but so far she looks as good or better than she ever did I always focused but this is the most aggressive I've ever seen her even when she was a champion yeah maybe she did gain that maybe that Boss reminded her that she's not immortal, and that could be a very powerful thing. Yeah. Their eyes aren't even gold, they're just plain silver. Hit. Lena. Whoa. Lena saw it, but Lena oh, is man. ready. I think Lena might have studied them tapes, man. <laughs> but even if you do, ah, she's still gonna get you. She's still gonna get you. Strong. She must have made an impression. But so is Lena. Like I said, me, senpai. Like I said, Lena should have the attack power to take Teresa down, even without the Giga Slave. Yes, but firepower is nothing but precision and aim. Lena is showing some spunk here. This is the first time these two have ever fought each other. Oh. <laughs> I told you, man. I told you. Man, Teresa better watch out. Look at Teresa staggering. Wow. Oh. Oh. <laughs> she hey, answered man. right yeah. back. Payback's a bitch. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Lena was setting something up, but now Teresa is in control. Yeah, you're not 
getting up easy tonight. Right back in the corner. Now Teresa's going up high. Oh. What can you say? She looks so good, mine. Again! Ah. Man, that didn't result in a KO, but you gotta think, Lena is... She would have been beat if, if this was a pinfall match. She would have been beat like two minutes ago after the first one. This girl has crawled to the road. Wow. Lena, if you're gonna break out something, Gotta do something now. Yeah, that Ricky Dink little kick ain't gonna do it. Roll around as much as you want, but it doesn't matter unless you get some punches in. Now Lena's head gets slammed off the barrack oh! and, and falls right into the kick and then falls on the stairs on the way down. She's been aiming for her head all night, man. That is Lena's weakness. She is somewhat of a glass cannon. She's treating Lena like a human pinata. But look at what just happened. Lena threw Teresa <laughs> into the stairs. And she does it again. If Lena can sustain a few big attacks. <laughs> now they're having a contest over who could throw who into the stairs harder. Her durability is really showing off right now. But if this were a game of points. Teresa would definitely be in the lead. Oh shit, now you're in big time trouble, Lena. Big, big time trouble. <laughs> oh my god. There's the first oh. back hole. <laughs> Oh, Lena avoided that. Maybe she did a recovery spell on herself. I am at a loss of words for what has transpired this night from match one all the way to the present time. But look at those. <laughs> nope. Now, Teresa. Yeah, she's just rubbing it in her face, man. And you know, you signed both of these, so tell me, man. never mind. How do you feel? Who you? Who are you looking at to win this match? I don't know. I love these two. I love both of these two so much. I, it's hard to say. Oh God! And Motoko too. I'm like they're like they're my three favorite female fighters, man. Battle of the signings. Oh, oh shit! shit. Oh. Ah. But Lena's still hanging tough. And as we've seen. She has the move set that could change the flow of a match in one move. She really needs to land one right now. 
You really know who to sign. Oh! Off the post again. Lena's a tough cookie, though. She will hang in there as long as it takes. In the face, man. Oh, but <clears throat> ah, ah, ah. well, Lena saw something there. Now it's Teresa off the post. This may be the most brutal match in the women's, like the whole women's tournament. This is the first one this turn with the upper hand. Oh shit, payback! Here we go! <laughs> I told you! <laughs> oh, oh man. Lena's not somebody you can gloat over until she's down. She will find a spell to blast you your ass. I know the chat gotta be going crazy right now. Cause I know we are. Especially up here in the tower. Our tower is invisible, by the way. In yes. these arenas. It's, it's kind of nifty, actually. You feel like you're sitting on air. Courtesy of the Invisibilis. Now might lead him out to come back here. The food I'm eating is Imaginese. And it's actually nutritious. Yeah, man. I can't believe it. Oh, shit. Now they're going up the ramp. Oh. <laughs> what a match. But Lena is still behind, and she needs something. And she the went for something. Taking over the entire show, man. Uh, oh, 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 oh. Oh, was that Teresa holding her stomach? Teresa's really showing. Oh, man. Maybe she's showing off a little bit too much. She's been pulling off a lot of impressive stunts in this match, but maybe it's gonna cost her a little bit too much because like you said, she was looked like she was holding her stomach, man. Yeah, I mean maybe Teresa feels a need to compensate for the loss of her invincibility like that. Yeah, man. She's hurting. But Lena can't really connect with a big, powerful attack. Might, oh, might this be a chance for oh. her? Oh! Mm -hmm. Teresa saying, stay in your lane. She's pulling off some last preserve moves right now. Ooh. Now that pole is in the way. We apologize, ladies and gentlemen. We will not, not see what is happening. We can definitely see what is happening on the oh, here we go. Teresa again got the better of the exchange. get the feeling this match is about to have a very abrupt ending and I don't know who the winner is going to be. I'm scared right now. Oh! Anything can happen. See yeah, what I mean? Man? I don't think change. I don't think any of Teresa's competitors hurt her this much last year, aside, of course, from the Cheetah Cyber. Lena is still behind, but she is hurting. 
the former champion right now. And if you want to get a point, then the best way to do it. Physics are getting weird again. Man, you know how the history is on those. Uh-oh, Teresa Ooh. won the fight. She took some punishment, but she won the fight. We're about to see a repeat occurrence, but will it be enough to take out Lena? Oh! Oh! And it is. Teresa threw to the finals after a tougher fight than she might have expected. But did we truly get to see everything that Lena Inverse had to offer? No, we didn't see the Giga Slave for starters. No Raga Blade, Dragon Slave. And she, she really didn't have time. But she still put up a fight like that. Yeah. But you know mine? It's Teresa versus Motoko again.